Taurus. Hey guys, welcome to Sister Girl Reading. It's Sister Saro. It is April Perry. How you doing? April Nicole speaking. It's been a pleasure. If you get a chance, check out the Pisces Redo. That shit was crazy. All right, Taurus. I'm gonna get into your reading. We ain't gonna stop. We are gonna get right into it because I gotta do your reading and get me a nail brush to fix my finger. I did my nails. I'm not done with them yet, but that's why I kind of got to. I like to do my nails for fun. It's like my new trade. Okay. I'm going to go to nail school watch. Taurus, what is the energy for June 2020? You got Billie Holiday, Albert Einstein, Mary Chalet, and Millennium Trump at the bottom of the deck. You are also playing, like Pisces, you're also playing the side. You're like the arm candy of someone. Taurus, you might actually walk around and feel like you have a past or people look at you and judge you wrongly. Um, maybe you're trying to be something different. You might be very shy or timid or maybe you don't speak a lot. You could find yourself replicating other people or trying to find your way. You could be very awkward. Um, Taurus, it seems like um, you... You always get put behind, so you walk in front. Maybe you're not in unison with your partner. Maybe you just kind of speed off and leave them in the dust. He is kind of old, so he's kind of behind her. Maybe you're trying to leave. Um, you feel like you don't really know, or maybe you're married to someone important and don't even know it. Um, you might feel like you betray yourself, or you don't really love yourself, or you give everything to your relationships. And but you rather keep people close. I do see that. Um, I do get Billie Holiday. I do see here that um, she was a very, very beautiful singer, but she um, she had a very tragic demise. I believe she was in an abusive relationship. I think I heard. I'm not sure. My dad listened to a lot of Billie Holiday. Um, it seems like you're in a relationship and you won't really know when it's time to leave until it's time to leave. Maybe you'll find some support in a very dark place, but it seems like your relationship's kind of like shadowy. Um, it says that uh, objects in the mirror are closer than they appear. Maybe something appears one way and is really another. And the distance between two objects is very relative. Maybe you feel like you're either smothered or you need distance or space. And the simple things are the most complex. Maybe some a relationship is very that seems very like easy is very like very complex or a lot to it. Uh, the beginning is always today. Maybe you're looking for a new start. Elegance is inferior to virtue. Maybe you pride yourself on virtue. So you could be trying to be virtuous, trying to be uh, dedicated to a situation, even though you feel like you want to be a hoe. <laughs> All right. What is Billie Holiday for Taurus? Yeah, um, you are thinking about... You don't know how long you could take something. Seven of Wands can be like brink of insanity, losing their mind. You could be wanting a divorce. It, this whole relationship could be turning you angry. Maybe you're abusive. Billie Holiday was abused. Um, or she was a very sad, solemn relationship. Something, some a divorce is making you very hurt, very bitter. What is the King of Swords reverse? Like, it's making you, it could be a Libra you're dealing with. Maybe you're fighting with them in court. The star, you can be very depressed or or someone's in a very false sense of security. Maybe someone left or they're being shedded. They could be shedding your family. Um, you'd be disappointed, but it's telling you to rebuild. You're just overwhelmed. You are a father figure. I don't advise you leaving your family. That could be your thoughts because the King of Swords is very angry. They don't they don't use their intellect for the best reasons when they're reversed. You could be thinking about leaving your family, but it's like it doesn't make any sense because you're a very good father and that's not how you act. What is Albert Einstein for Taurus 2020? Yeah, um, the King of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. <clears throat> you feel like a lot is on you. Maybe you can't find a job or maybe you're trying to make money or maybe everything you try to build just falls apart. Um, you feel like you have to compete. Maybe you're a business owner and maybe you feel like you just don't have what it takes. Uh, what is three of pentacles in verse for Taurus? Could be a male, could be a masculine. Judgment. Maybe you feel like you like somebody. Could be the queen of cups, but you feel like you're not, you guys aren't going anywhere. You kind of want to, 
Um, it could be ghosting a Sagittarius or a Virgo. You feel like this person is lying to you. They're keeping secrets or they're not fully engaging. They're not real. You don't really, um, you don't really know where you stand with this person. It could be a younger fire sign. You just, this person, um, this person knows you're going to divorce them. They're not stupid. This person knows about your wake up call. They know. They're not stupid. They actually probably want to ghost you too. They're like, they want to leave too. Someone is a, someone is very intuitive. Someone makes very good decisions. Someone is very intuitive. Uh, they may not keep their word. Sometimes they may be, uh, huh. But they, they mean what they, I mean, as far as temperance goes, like someone, someone is trying to balance the situation out and heal it. Someone could be thinking about going to therapy. Um, I do see here, someone could be thinking about that. Someone doesn't know where they stand. It's a lot of emotional complications, a lot of victimization going on. What was me? But there's a lot of broken hearts in this situation. What is Mary, Mary Chalet for um, uh, Taurus? Yeah, the high priestess. Ooh, you could be turned out off of some people. Maybe you don't want anyone new. A new beginning starts today. Now you're turning out somebody named Mary or Chalet or Mary Chalet or Billy or Albert. You could be turning people down. This could be um, someone in the past that could have been a mistress, five of swords. Yeah, mistress. Someone could have been someone's side piece on the back of the day. Someone, someone was set, they felt sexually charged towards someone. They made a lot of bad decisions when they were left out in the cold or they let this person out in the cold. Someone did something deceptive. What's the two of wands and the five of pentacles? Ten of cups. Yeah. Someone made a bad decision to leave someone out in the cold. Yeah, they tried to, something was hard to build. And they were trying to build with someone else. Five to seven, like someone just left what they didn't have and built somewhere else. So it's like the element of this relationship didn't work. So I'm going to go off and be with somebody else, basically. All right. All right. All right. Let's see. Taurus, Taurus, I asked why. All right. Taurus, what's the energy for you? Oh, no, what? no, 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 no. How do you see a partner? Mary and Antoinette, how do you see a partner? That's a, that's a suffrage? What is how Taurus sees their mate? Sigmund Freud. Elizabeth, the Queen Elizabeth. Hold on. How does Taurus see their mate? How does Taurus see their mate? My bad, my hands get ashy. I should have done that when I was um doing my nails. I just went straight in, y'all. Ricky Martin came out. Mary Shelley said the bottom of the deck. Four marriage relationships. Um, the first one that came out was be the dessert, not the entree. You want to be like the sweet, the icing on the cake. No man is worth losing your head over. You don't want to lose your, your head over a woman or a man. You have how you see. It's like someone doesn't want to lose their head over you. You... Someone is very loving and caring and they forgive. They're very forgiving or compassionate. Maybe you forgive this person for what they've done. The virtuous content. Yeah, you, you, I think that this person, you think this person daydreams about doing wicked things or you're thinking about doing wicked things, Taurus. Um, the behavior of sexual, of human and sexual matters is often a prototype for his whole life. Wow. So basically how you behave is pretty much how you'll react. So you don't think someone's pure feminine or pure masculine. It's just kind of a blend. Ricky Martin, someone is very sexy. Um, not saying Ricky Martin's sexy, but that's his emblem. Um, sex like exercise. You think that someone's very attractive. Um, the crowd can go wild, but love is something secret. You're only your secret heart knows. So you feel like, even though someone is very public or in the public eye or very known, you feel like you know what it is between you and them's person. And you keep your friends tight. Maybe you guys are very tight like. You guys are more friends. They have the heart of a man. Yeah, I get that this person is very masculine and feminine. They don't want to be single and beggar. They want to be a queen. And they, they keep it real with a clear conscience. They don't lie. They don't sugarcoat. So this is how you see your mate. How does your mate see you? Boris? 
Yoko Ono, Diana, Princess of Wales, Baldas, your partner, CU Taurus. A lot of women. If you're a man, Taurus, they, uh, you see this person um, as a horny motherfucker. Jay-Z came out and Jacqueline Kenny Onassis. Is how they see you. Journal Park at the bottom of the deck. Princess Wales and Yoko came out first. Better to have one night of pleasure than one night of misery. So it's like someone feels like you're, you're a one night stand. Don't ask, don't tell. DNA tests are for commoners. Is someone trying to paint a baby on you? Damn. So you had sex with somebody and now they want a DNA test. The truth is there are many. Yeah, you cheating like a motherfucker, Taurus. Somebody see you as a cheating dog ass loser. Like you ain't shit. Um, yes is always the answer. Like you, you, you go for anything. Love is a performance art that takes place amongst the clouds. It's like dream. You leave people the impression that they're in relationships with you, and maybe you're a spiritual hoe or something like that. Jay Z, like you a hoe? Yeah, one off deals. Yeah, like you, maybe you will give the appearance that you're not interested in one night stands until you feel like it's really gonna be worth something. You're looking for. Um, they feel like. They want a partner that's gonna be that's that's gonna be just like them. And that you married them for money or you're with them for money. So yeah, it's like someone feels like you a hoe when you've only married them for money and that um you leave them in a dream state and that you are looking for someone that's gonna be what you want them to be, not necessarily who they are. Damn. Towards y'all. What is Jay-Z? for Taurus. The Emperor. It's his motherfucking ass. Someone is someone doesn't want you to control them. Like you're controlling as fuck, Taurus. You are a male Taurus, black male. Yoko Ono. Cards for that Taurus. Cards for Yoko Ono for Taurus. I think no cards. Yoko Ono cards for Taurus. Damn, I fought that one. King of Cups and the Justice card. I'm going to take them. Yeah, someone feels like they're trapped in a marriage or trapped in a situation. They feel like they, they, they're they getting divorced for juggling or cheating. Yeah, someone is trying to cover something up that's going to arise. Damn. Diana, Princess of Wales for Taurus. Someone trying to kill their baby mama or their girlfriend or something. King of Swords. Ace of Wands, yeah, someone, yeah, someone trying to kill that girl. Damn, Taurus. Yeah, someone is crazy as hell. Somebody is crazy and holding on to your ass, or you could be holding on to this person. You're depressed about somehow someone shared you, and they they left you and they became somebody. So yeah, it seemed like you cheated on somebody and they left your ass and became somebody, and that's your punishment. Damn, or this could be the other person and you got successful. Uh, what is Jacqueline Kennedy or Nasus? It is the Seven of Swords getting caught the fuck up. So someone is either finding out the truth or this person is getting busted. Damn. Okay. Um, The Hermit, the Chariot. Yeah, somebody left because they heard some gossip about you, Taurus. They heard that you wasn't shit. They left. They left quick. Yeah, they got their money and dipped. Yep, somebody left and came to successful and they left your ass where you was and you ain't got no money, no inheritance, you enslaved that. Damn, Five of Swords. Well, yeah, Five of Swords, because you play games. This is your, this is your shit. You did this, Five of Cups. It's all you. All these fives are yours. All these motherfuckers are yours. And then the Empress right here. So you know what I think? You know what I think? I think you did some shit, Taurus, and you got caught the fuck up and now you upset you disappointed and you want to fight and holler with this woman and she ain't do shit. Could be your baby mama or something. You mad because your third party went too far and now you, your baby mama or girlfriend coming up to you confronting you and your wife or girlfriend's like, deuces! Seems like you got a personal problem. Could be dealing with a Virgo. If you are, a Virgo is telling all your secrets. They're the one gossiping trying to get your woman. Could be dealing with a cancer. Cancer's trying to get it released. Could be a Capricorn. The Capricorn be spreading drama. Could be giving somebody money to start a business. Yeah, you got all types of enemies, Taurus. Damn. Well, Taurus, I mean, did Taurus, is Taurus guilty? Is Taurus guilty? 
Let's hope not. It's towards guilty. I have a car doesn't feel right. It's towards guilty. Okay, that feels right. Ten of Pentacles, disinheritance, old baggage. Old baggage. Oh, see, this is what I get. The, the King of Pentacles was bored, right? He's a methodical man, doesn't cheat, very faithful. He got tempted, right? He went back to some old shit that he know he had no business doing. And now he was contemplating having some type of intellectual relationship. And now it's getting out. Someone was contemplating on cheating. What's the Nine of Swords? Three of Wands. Yeah, someone was thinking about not coming back to that lover. They were trying to plan. They were going to end up losing anyway. Spirit was going to get them back. At least somebody broken and un un just pretty much devastated. But it seemed like this person came up and you got fucked up. So basically, you fucked this person over and you got the big ass stick in the dick. Damn. Well, Taurus, uh, <laughs> you lost tomato sauce after Wild Crocodile. And, um, hmm. well, I hope this ain't for everybody. But if it is for you, you need to get a book of personal reading. 702-969-5427. And I'll be glad to talk to you about this because this shit look crazy. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.